So, we're on um, day 36 today of the snake diet. Yesterday, I came in at 312.8 pounds. Um, something like about, I lost about 5-ish pound-ish. Which I thought was pretty good. Like I said, it's not my water weight. A bit of poo weight. Um, I don't even see this. Uh, I'm getting a bit of a, I've got a spot that's been coming, going, coming, going. It's like I'm breaking out in purity. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Uh, as long as I don't keep touching it, like I just touched it just then. I should be alright, but it's a very annoying. You get a big spot on your nose. Alright, let's see um, how much weight I've lost. Did I just say I need a new battery or what? I can't believe the amount of batteries you need for this. Do it again. Three ten point six. Definitely bought a new battery and then after we've done this. Three ten point six. Ooh. Three ten point six. Three ten point six. Well, I'm going out today to the shop, so um, measure well buy some of those batteries. I'll just get new, new scales with some real batteries in it because there's them brown ones you see, those C ones. But anyway, so yeah, I've lost two point two pounds, um, and from yesterday I lost five, so I that's about seven point two pounds I've lost in a couple of days. But I said to you, I should get up to three hundred pounds by Monday. I think that was overstretching it a little bit, that was. But it's Wednesday today, so yeah, it's not going to happen because I bought some um, organic ox heart, ox liver uh, burgers. I've got some ox liver, ox heart, organic steak mince. Um, got some organic, basically organic stuff, beef, lard. Bit of liver, um, some other things. I've had a well, lot of them on Friday and Saturday. I was going to fast till Saturday, but I wanted to take advantage of this offer. Plus, I've been looking to find a good way to eat liver and heart without eating liver and heart. And um, eating any burgers or statements seems like a good way to go. The only thing is, out of yesterday, I was hungry. Like, all day. I was hungry, apart from when I got to the night time and I went to sleep and I was alright then but all day I was hungry and I couldn't believe it but I said well, well I'm not going to eat anything, I'm not hungry because I don't need to eat because I've got this big fat belly on me, I'm hungry and I've, I think this is why I'm hungry but I've seemed to um, develop a um, Pepsi Max caffeine free addiction. I know it's awful. I've never drunk so much Pepsi Max in all my life. Not the normal Pepsi Max, but the one with no caffeine in it, making it not addictive. And the answer to yourself is, why the hell have I developed an addiction to it when there's no caffeine in it? Uh. So you know there's some dodgy stuff going down in the Pepsi Max headquarters, you know they put something in it. Don't know what they put in it. I'm not accusing that they put anything in it. I know the poison is in it because they put could have stayed with the bottles. There's nothing in the bottle. Now there isn't. I, I digress. I digress. This is what I'm going. And I've been on a coffee a bit as well, but that's my own fault. So yeah. So I'm trying to knock this um, Pepsi Max on the head now. Um, I've got one right in front of me to be honest with you. I've got some coffee and I'm trying to keep it. I'm going out after. Going to see if I should buy a table one of those. Coat anger things, you know, those wood ones, but yeah, so far, so far, feels in 10.6 pounds, 10.6 pounds away from my first go away. Feels like it's going slow, but it's not compared to people on other diets, you know. I've got like another friend on Facebook, 
And she's like, oh, I'm really happy, I'm going a pound a week. And she's on a really crappy diet, I think slim will weight loss or like that. And, you know, the, you're designed to fail. Yeah, that's why I want you to only lose a pound a week. Because they designed it so you fail, so you buy the next time, so you fail, you go and go crazy, you come back, you go on a diet, you buy the same food again, you know. Oh, I lost £10 in six months, you know, that kind of, yeah. So, based on that, I am doing absolutely fantastic. Based on people who actually really hardcore do the snake diet, they're doing it a hell of a lot better than me. But that's the way it's cookie crumbles, and at least I've given up the sugar, so that's good for me. So I will see you on Friday and see how I'm actually going. Have a good one, and I hope you are inspired.